All right. Hello, everybody. Travis Chandler, Chandler Gaming, back with the next episode of Mass Effect 3. Bar recording, great. All right, cool. All right. We'll load up my manual save, because I like to save manually after I do missions and get done with a video, so that way I know where I'm at and all that fun stuff, so anyway, let's read what messages we got here. Oh, Ashley Williams! She is becoming a specter! She wants us to come to the hospital and see her. Miranda wants me to come see her too. So we'll see about doing that here in a minute. first we need that next thing we need is to go down to the shuttle bay for the armory so I can work on my weapons because I found the setup and I'll show you how it works there it is okay so I only use my pistol um Oh, it increases damage. The piercing mod is what we want. Okay. Valkyrie we could use. Okay. Okay. Let me see if I can get some upgrades here. I need it for the Valkyrie. But actually, I need to buy something first. We'll buy the Sunfish. The Aquarium BI, that was the other thing I wanted. That way, then, it can take care of my fish for me. Um... I'm looking for the... Assault Rifle Ultra Light is what I'm looking for. Piercing Mod 2. Would be a nice little one to have. There it is. That's what I'm looking for right here. You pay 10% more buying it on the ship, but, um, oh well. It's easier to buy it now than...
There we go. We'll buy the model too, why not? There we go. Okay, so let me explain what I want to do here. Oop, there we go. Um, But it doesn't reduce the weight, god damn it. Okay, let me take these off. Let me... I want that piercing wand. Yeah, for some reason, it will not let me... Okay. Okay, so the piercing wand, what it does, it allows bullets to pierce... 0.65 meter thick objects, but at 55% reduced damage. Ignores 35% of defenses on armored targets. Capacitor boosts kinetic coil generators increases shot penetration. And I did the same thing with the M7 Eagle. what you could also do, and this is probably what I'm going to do, is I'm going to um, put on the heavy barrel, which increases damage by 35%. But we'll, we'll do the, we'll do this one first. Okay. And then next we're going to do um, the next DLC, is what we'll do. On the Citadel. So we'll go to Dr. Bryson's lab. Now, I believe you have to have um, Edie for this. the map. They contact the field teams for a progress report. Yes, sir. Oh, Commander Shepard, we've been expecting you. Just a moment. And Hadley, could you gather the Leviathan data for us? So this is the Levi Leviathan DLC. The team is out investigating leads right now. I'm Dr. Garrett Bryson, and this is Task Force Aurora. What's your assignment? Our mandate is to investigate legends, rumors, old stories about the Reapers before anyone knew they existed. Could have used your help three years ago. Yes. If people had paid more attention to your Prothean beacon, we might not be in this war. But now with new information we've uncovered, a breakthrough's near. Hadley, do you have the data? No! <laughs> This is Commander Shepard. I need C-Sec at my location, now! You shouldn't be here. The darkness can't be breached. Transit records show his name is Derek Hadley. He's worked here for a couple months. Shepard, I monitored a C-Sec alert from this location. Were you harmed? I'm fine. But I could use your help sorting this out, Edie. Take a look through their files. I need to know what this task force was up to. At once. What? I... What's happening? You just shot your boss. He's dead. Why? Exactly. After you arrived, it was dark. Cold. 
like I was somewhere else. Take a good look. You did that. You pulled the trigger and killed him. No. No. I couldn't have. But you did. No! I'm not a murderer! I saw you pull the trigger. Then you tried to kill me. I swear I didn't! Commander, this does resemble reports of indoctrination. Indoctrination? Me? What about that Leviathan Bryson mentioned? How does that tie in? It's some kind of creature. Our field teams have been tracking it. That artifact came in from our researcher, Garneau. He sent an audio log if you wanna... What's wrong? Turn back. What are you talking about? The darkness cannot be breached. Damn it. Get them over to the clinic. See if they can tell us what's wrong with them. Yes, sir. Commander, you'll want to see this. It's an outgoing message from Dr. Bryson to Admiral Hackett. Dr. Bryson, you have an update? Admiral, the Leviathan of Dis that we've been investigating, I think we're really onto something. Give me the brief. About 20 years ago, the Batarians discovered a Reaper corpse that had died in battle. They covered it up and denied it ever existed. But I'm intrigued by the larger implication. What could have killed the Reaper in the first place? Exactly. That's the real Leviathan. It's worth pursuing. Continue your investigation and update me on the progress. There is also a follow-up message from a few weeks later. Admiral, the Reapers are shadowing my field teams as if they're hunting Leviathan themselves. Whatever it is, I believe Leviathan is nothing less than a Reaper killer. Almost an apex predator, and it has them nervous. If we could just find it, imagine the impact on the war. I'm formally requesting assistance in tracking it down. You'll have it. This is now your top priority, Doctor. Find that thing. It appears we were meant to be that assistance. I see Bryson's point. Anything capable of bringing a Reaper down is worth finding. Exactly! Despite the potential dangers it could pose, I would agree. But we won't know unless we can find it. Bryson's assistant did say they recently received a log from their field researcher. It may yield more information. This must be the artifact the assistant mentioned. And here's the log. Dr. Bryson, it's Garneau. I'm sending you an artifact I found. About the only thing I found there, in fact. Maybe it's nothing, but... I'd swear Leviathan came through here. I'm gonna crunch some numbers. Burn up the rest of this project travel allowance. Maybe I can project our Reaper killer's movements. I'll check in when I get to the next site. Garneau appears to be our best lead to track Leviathan, but he does not state a destination. Let's focus on what he does say, then. He mentioned extrapolating Leviathan's path. And crunching numbers. He wasn't flying blind. He had data. A significant amount of data, judging by this office. So how do we narrow it down? Bryson and his colleagues evidently used a galaxy map search program in their hunt for Leviathan. It may help us locate Garneau. Okay, so what you have to do, you have to find the data that, um... You need to locate where they're at. Does this tell us where Garnon went? No. But we may be able to narrow down his location if we find clues he was using in his search for Leviathan. Okay, so now we search the labs. Okay, we had to turn on the map. Okay, so... Bryson was tracking unexplained creature sightings. Bryson was not merely tracking sightings. He was attempting to extrapolate a course. And Garneau could have been following that course. Edie, can you add a search filter for systems along that projected path? Add the search filter. You may examine the results on the Galaxy Map program. We will, here in a minute. Meteorite fragment, maybe? He was studying it as an object of importance. We should look more closely at a sample. Meteorite sample. With traces of element zero. Would Leviathan need Ezo? 
While it is not consumed as fuel during FTL travel, Element Zero will decay after several centuries of active use. If Leviathan is old enough, it would need to replenish its supplies. Okay. Can you give me a search filter for locations with Element Zero? Adding this search filter to the galaxy map. There's two. There's five of them. We'll take that. Looks like data on the Rachni. By Ann Bryson. Age 9. This is March 7th, 2186. I'm looking at the Rachni. Their movements during the Rachni Wars suggest alien influence. But the timing is wrong. And Rachni weren't implanted with Reaper tech. What if Leviathan was preparing the Rachni to fight the Reapers? What do you think, Edie? It is possible that Bryson's team is using ancient Rachni fleet activity to find Leviathan. We saw a data pad containing data on Rachni movements earlier. It may be relevant. The Rachni data. Can you add a cross-reference for locations of sightings? Adding the search filter now. Okay, there's number three. Sovereign, vanguard of our destruction. How's that working out for you, big guy? This appears to be encrypted data on Reaper fleet activity. You think it's relevant? Possibly. But it is impossible to say without more data. And the decryption key. Sir, this is Bryson. We know the Reapers are after Leviathan. Studying Reaper hunting patterns could be vital to finding it. That data is classified top secret, Dr. Bryson. If it falls into the wrong hands... It won't. The data's encrypted. I'll keep the decryption key safe. Close to my heart. Close to his heart? What the hell does that mean? The Reaper fleet activity is encrypted, per Bryson's statement in the log. He said he was keeping the decryption key close to his heart. By Anne Bryson. Age 9. Records indicate Anne is now 28. She works for the Alliance. Bryson was keeping the encryption key close to his heart. What's closer than family? An interesting hypothesis. But I detect no trace of the decryption key in this... art. I always forget where all this stuff is. Um, I know there's one up here. There it is. Another piece of Anne Bryson's childhood art. Wait a minute. Well, take a look at that. I can use these numbers to construct a decryption key. All right. Let's get back to the data pad we found earlier. There it is. Decryption complete. Analyzing data. These movements do not match the standard invasion pattern. The Reapers are searching for something. And I'll bet Garneau used this intel. Can you make a search filter for it? Adding it now. Okay. Is there anything out here? I don't think so. Take that.
we'll take that. Reaper activity. Based on the search results, Garno is in one of these five systems. I have marked the Normandy map with possible locations. We can leave now, unless you wish to further narrow the search. Oh, we're gonna further narrow the search, all right. Element zero deposits. Three possibilities. Brachni activity. No results. Some of our search parameters may be irrelevant. Three possibilities. Alien sightings. We have a match. Marking the galaxy map. All right. Good. Let's go find Garneau. Okay, there's only four. I thought there was five. No, there's four. These are all murders in which the accused lacked a known motive and claimed memory loss. Just like Bryson's assistant. You think Garneau was following a trail of blackout crimes? It is possible. We need to find data matching dates and locations for crimes of this nature. Here's the time and date chart for the crimes. Can you build it for There's the filter. The yep. So there's a fit. Doing so now. All right. But we already know where to go, so. We are going to go back to the Normandy so we can get this done. Okay. Now that we got the aquarium VI, we don't need to worry about the fish. Okay, here we go. There's the diplomats. Students. Artifacts. Scan for Garnell. Yep. All right. Since there's no Reapers around here. Oh, I take that back. There are Reapers here. Uh, we don't need to be fighting them right now. We don't need to be fighting them right now. And I know he's on a planet. Signal confirmed. We have located Garneau. Okay, but before we go, I want to look around. There it is. I'll take that fuel. Always look around for your um, resources, you know, or assets as they call it. And here's where we land. We're gonna bring out Javik and Edie because we need to set those two up. Mr. Javik, you get a particle rifle.
repair. There. Okay, so Javik's gonna do good. Edie's gonna do good. There. All right, we need to get Edie set up here. Power or health and shields. we do power for her. All right, and then we'll have her be a support character. We want her to just at least learn everything. Okay. Overload would be good. Incinerate would be good. Defense Matrix would be good. Decoy would be decent. We'll do Chain. Neurochalk. And we'll do chain overload when we get enough. Okay. And then Javik. Power. Power. Ooh. We'll get the squad bonus of um, power damage, duration, and force by 10%. Hell yeah, we will. That's nice. Okay, lift grenade. Pull. Slam. We're probably going to do dark channel. Duration. We'll do damage. Slow and pierce. All right, and then lift grenade would be a good one to have. Okay, damage or radius? Radius. Okay, cool. We're about five minutes out, Commander. What exactly is on this asteroid? Mining facility. TGS Mineral Works. Small operation. Could be a good place for Leviathan to hide. We've all read Edie's notes on Bryson's lab. Any questions? Do we know anything more about this Leviathan? Not really. We only know it killed a Reaper. But it is Garneau, Dr. Bryson's associate, that we are looking for. Right. If we find Garneau, we find Leviathan. Agreed. Powerful enough to take down a Reaper, but hiding from the war. There's more to this. I just hope Garneau has the answers we need. I'm reading Reaper enemy signatures in the asteroid field. Brayson said they were shadowing his field teams. If they're after Leviathan 2, Reapers are a good sign. That's not something you hear every day. Yeah, that's true, it's not. Take us in. <laughs> Go 
Don't go anywhere, Cortez. We'll grab this guy and be right out. Keep me updated on the Reaper situation. Yes, Commander. Okay, down the elevator we go. Scouting party. Or worse, by the sounds of it. We just Internal killed those two brutes situation. like they were nothing. It's likely the civilians would be frightened. We killed those bastards like they were nothing. <laughs> Hell yeah. See, this is what I loved about Mass Effect 3 is building the characters like this. That's what I love. The loading screens were pretty cool in this game, too. DGS Mineral Works. All guests need to sign in at reception. They should be panicked. Oh, shit. Bugga bugga bugga! <laughs> I'm Commander Shepard of the Alliance. You just had Reaper troops attacking your front door. Are they still there? I've taken care of them for now. I see. That will be all. That will be. Hello? Yes, welcome to TGS Mineral Works. How can we help you? Yes, for the tour. Please sign in. You don't seem worried about those Reapers. You know something I don't? TGS Mineral Works is a small to mid-level supplier of tungsten to the galaxy. That's not what I meant. Are you familiar with the applications of Tungsten? I'm looking for a researcher named Dr. Garneau. Oh. I'll, I'll be, be right back. Within the last couple weeks. If he's still here, I need to speak to him. We have no Dr. Garneau. Do you need to see a doctor? How about I just go in and look around? No. The access elevator is broken. And now, we're done. Step away. Step away. You don't belong here. Commander, something is wrong here. Let's look around. Be careful. No, sorry about that. Um, I'm expecting a call from somebody and thought it was them. It wasn't. I will call security. Welcome to TGS Mineral Works. Proud providers of tungsten since 2162. Excuse me. You don't belong here. Okay. The people seem fearful. It is difficult to determine why, but he does. We should repair the elevator. To think about that. Okay, there's the phone again.
Alright. Here we go. I'm looking for a Dr. Garneau. I don't know what you mean. Oh, is this where you're gonna stay with the drone? But we have to stay with it. Yeah, that's right. I remember this. Yeah. Here we go. Look at the elevator mentioned in Dr. Gondo. Why are they lying about that? No idea. Let's hope we don't have to look too far. Okay. We'll both go to the mineral lab, so And I'm sorry. Have you seen Dr. Gardo? Evolutionary implications of human biotics. I see a trend among the miners. They appear to be doing everything but mining. Okay. Even has to make 60 days for complete global starvation. It's the merciful run. Absolutely. That's the data to use. Okay, I think we go into the crew quarters first, because I think that's where the extra stuff is. This is a restricted area. Personnel ID number is required. I don't okay. have that. Access denied. Okay, so we have to have the ID number. I forgot about that. Yes, we have to have the ID number. Okay. The train thing for I don't have one. Access denied. Turn back. You don't belong here. Yeah. I'm getting that feeling. Okay. Okay, I think that's where we're supposed to go. Stupid. Goddamn, um, representatives are calling looking for donations for their campaign. Fuck you, assholes. Attention. Comm system is offline. This message was not sent. Grayson, it's Garnell. I've had to go into hiding, and I need you to come get me. I found another one of those artifacts here. More important than we realized. It's in the mines. Here's the nav point. That's where I'll be. If something happens, I'm attaching a passcode that I hacked together. It'll open any security terminal. Bryson, something is very wrong here. Please hurry. Or no out. So, he's still here. Do we have that passcode hack? Yes. Just input it at the security terminal. He sure will here in a second. Again, fuckers. Hello? Uh, uh, 
open. Punch in Garneau's terminal hack and see what it gets us. Access granted. A ship dropped him off a week ago. It appears he had full access at one point before going into hiding. Unknown male was involved in an altercation in the mines. This gone no human was headed to the mines. Looks like he was taken to the med bay. You are in the mineral lab. A low security, all access area. The med bay is restricted to authorized personnel with active patient file numbers. I have the file number. Let's go get Garneau. Isn't there a locked door back there? I think so. Isn't there? I forgot about that. There's a locked door back here, isn't there? I thought you could do I guess not bastards why do they even put that make that door active when they know you can't get in it you know come on Yeah. If you are looking for Garneau, you have found him. I am Dr. Garneau. I'm Commander Shepard of the Alliance. Are you alright? Yes. Only I'm trapped in here. What's been going on in this place? I was doing my research. Until the incident. They attacked you. It's true. But aside from my confinement, I'm fine. Whatever's going on here, I need you to focus. Of course, Commander. I need you to tell me everything you found on the Leviathan. Bryson seemed to think it killed a Reaper. It's a myth. A dead end. What of the artifact you spoke of in your message? I did? No. Yes, Doctor. You did. But now we've got Reaper forces attacking, so I need to break you up. We'll grab the artifact and go. Reapers. The darkness must not be breached. The darkness? Why do you pursue me? 
Doctor? Leave the artifact. You will not take what is mine. I don't believe we are speaking to Garneau. You. You killed a Reaper. I need your help. You bring We need to follow him. Someone has cut the power. There he goes. Leave this place. Wait! We need to get to that artifact before he does. He said it was in the mines. We'll need to find a different route. Gardo's notes gave us a nav point for the artifact. The map indicates a service door at the next tram station. Looks like we're not the only ones headed that way. I am noticing a pattern. Despite the law of averages, we never find reapers moving in a direction away from us. We'll take you. Drop you two motherfuckers. There you go. Nice job, man. Nice job. Take those out. Oh, shit. There's you. There's two banshees. Great. You're really not supposed to do this till later. There's the door. Okay, let's find that artifact. Damn, we just murdered that fucking Ravager. <laughs> nice. Aw, oh, we're not getting ammo. That sucks. We'll take that cranial trauma system. We'll need that for later, trust me. We will. What was that? Looks like the door's power supply has been cut. The trouble spots are out there. This drone can repair it. We'll need to escort it. Unfortunately, the drone is damaged and is on reserve power. Let's make it quick then. Okay. It's just stupid they're not giving me Ammo, man, come on. One repair done, one to go. Gotta hold on a little longer. Understood. Up we go. Ooh. Ooh. 
Here's some ammo. Nice. Stay close to the drone. Got it. Oh, great. Head back. Door should be online. Whoop! Oh, he's not gonna hood slide it? That sucks. There he hood slid. <laughs> the darkness cannot be breached. The Bryson's office. Move! I've got a shot! Turn back! Darno! Shepard, over here. What have you got? That was not Garneau. This is. It appears he's been dead for a while. Oh, shit. So, Leviathan can have Bryson killed, can take over this colony, and he can use them as puppets. Huh. Anything else useful? Encrypted data, and a personal log with eight missed calls from a Dr. Anne Bryson. And Bryson. Who... Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm Commander Shepard. Are you alright? I think so. I feel like... I feel strange, but... Alright. Do you recognize this man? I've never seen him before in my life. Someone here killed him. Someone here? How is that possible? I'm so sorry. Can you tell me anything about what happened to you? Not really. I, uh, remember... It just seemed cold. I remember a, a feeling... Cold and dark. If dark was a feeling, that's exactly what I felt. That artifact. Do you know where it came from? Came out of the mine. Right. Head office was supposed to send someone. That's about all I can... Cortez, what's your situation? Can you bring the shuttle? Affirmative. Strangest thing. A couple of minutes ago, the Reaper forces broke off and left. Reaper? What's a Reaper? What year do you think this is? 2176. Oh, shit. 2176 was 10 years ago. What? Let's arrange for these people to be evacuated into temporary quarantine. These people are unaware of the past 10 years. Many things will shock them. Seems Leviathan not only has the power to destroy a Reaper, but possesses an indoctrination ability. What if it is a Reaper? If it's a Reaper, we need to know its motivations. How long has it been out here? And more importantly, why? Edie, did we get anything from Gardo's notes? Yes. They suggest that Garno created a way to block the artifact's mind-affecting properties. 
The artifact seems to be the key. Agreed. When I head back to Bryson's office, I want you there. Yes, Commander. I want to know just what the hell these artifacts really are and what they can do. Whatever they are, their power and danger are clear. And we've got one sitting right in the middle of the Citadel. Okay, so we're going back to the Citadel. Okay, we start the scanner here, just to get our resource, our asset here. Evasion successful. There it is. I knew there was some here. In we go. And out of here we go. All right, cool. Back to Bryson's lab we go. We need to shield the artifact they've got here right away. Using Garno's data, I should be able to accomplish this without difficulty. Damn thing's been here the whole time. Why weren't we affected? Perhaps the amount of time spent near the artifact is key. After a certain duration, it affords Leviathan an impressive mind control capability. If the Reapers are worried about it, then Leviathan has my attention. We could use that kind of edge. Nevertheless, we should remain cautious. It's likely that Leviathan compelled Bryson's assistant to murder him. Point taken. It just shows we don't know what we're dealing with. Despite the risk, this artifact remains our only link to finding Leviathan. Perhaps we could find more information about it here in the lab. Agreed. Bryson's team might have turned up something we missed. I'll look around. Okay. Bryson's assistant, Hadley. Do we have an update on his status? He is in a vegetative state. The doctors believe it is permanent. But the miners recovered when the artifact was destroyed. Hadley lost consciousness when he attempted to answer our questions about Leviathan. It may have been a deliberate attempt to silence him permanently. Okay, here's initial tests. They were testing the artifact for energy emissions. And found nothing. Still, I recommend leaving it shielded. Anything interesting about the artifact structure? It is not constructed of the same compounds used in standard Reaper technology. Beyond that, nothing of relevance.
Edie, what project was Garno working on when he found the artifact? Basilisk. Got anything on Basilisk? Several ships, a mythical creature, and a rare mid-tier enemy type in the Galaxy of Fantasy video game. It possesses a gaze attack capable of triggering synced animation kills. Player forums describe it as overpowered. <laughs> I meant the project, Edie. Oh. Then, no. There's gotta be That's cool. This artifact. Oof. What about the server? Look at that, man. Wiped the office server and destroyed all backups, likely before killing Bryson. However, records show new messages on Bryson's personal comm terminal upstairs. Could be worth a look. A message from Dr. Bryson's daughter, Anne. According to my records, she worked with her father. I'm at the dig site in the Pylos Nebula. Project Scarab paid off. I've got another artifact like the one Garneau found. I think it could be affecting people's behavior. You need to shield the one in your office. I tried to warn Garneau, but I can't get through. We've got Reaper scouts coming in toward the main site. I'm heading to the secondary base to grab what research I can. Anne Bryson was attempting to contact Garno on the asteroid colony. She seems to know something about the artifact. She sounded worried. If Reaper forces were approaching, her concern was warranted. Let's hope we get to her before they do. She said she was in the Pylos Nebula, working for Project Scarab. That cluster contains several systems. I'll call up the nebula on the galaxy map. We may also search the lab for clues to narrow down her location. Okay. Now we gotta look around here for more clues and filters and all that kind of shit. The Reapers. Let's hope we find Anne before they do. These are the ships Dr. Bryson and his team used? Yes. If we can find out which ship Anne Bryson took for Project Scarab, we may learn something. These are the ships Dr. Bryson and his team used? Yes. If we can find out which ship Anne Bryson took for Project Scarab, we may learn something. These are the ships Dr. Bryson and his team used? Yes. If we can find out which ship Anne Bryson took for Project Scarab, we may learn something. These are the ships Dr. Bryson and his team used? Yes. If we can find out which ship Anne Bryson took for Project Scarab, we may learn something. See, I hate this looking around bullshit. The MSV Kirkwall. Ann Bryson flew out on a ship called the Icarus. Can you track its movements? No. The Reapers have disrupted civilian comm buoys. But we might learn more if we find the ship's specifications. I believe... Any correlation between Project Scarab and these unexplained creature sightings? Not beyond Leviathan itself. Icarus. Here we go. The ship has enhanced electrostatic discharge cells. They facilitate long-range FTL travel. So they jumped to the Pylos Nebula by mass relay, then flew to another system. Yes. Otherwise, they would have chartered a less expensive ship. Okay. We can rule out the relay system. What about criminal activity in the Pylos Nebula? Because the area is part of the Attica Traverse, criminal reports are unreliable at best. Based on the search data, it is one of these two systems. The locker is secure. We must locate an access card to open it. See, this looking around shit, I, I just can't stand it. Any idea if Project Scarab involved Element Zero? Unlikely. We may learn more from the Project Requisitions Locker. 
Does anything in Ann Bryson's work history suggest where she might be? Nothing relevant. Can you identify this, Edie? It originates with a pre-spaceflight culture, but there are none recorded in the Pylos Nebula. Okay, I know there's a way to get it down to one possibility. I know that. I just don't know how to do it. And it's driving me nuts because I know there's a way to do it. We'll take that. Access card for the requisitions locker? Yes. According to records, it was last used by Ann Bryson to obtain equipment for Project Scarab. Let's see what Ann Bryson requisitioned for Project Scarab. Wind protection gear. Didn't need an environmental suit. Based on what Ann Bryson did or did not requisition, the dig site was arid but habitable. Get me a filter for systems with compatible planets. There we go. Cool. There we go. Based on the data, only one system remains viable possibility. Good. Let's go get Ann Bryson. All right. There we go. We got it now. Ah. Back to the Normandy. Now we know where we're going. No need to go on a wild goose chase. Okay. Diplomats, students, artifacts, big site. Here we go. I'm going to do the one we don't need to go to just so we can get the resources or the Assets, I should say. Signal confirmed. All right. Okay. There it is. Ah! Wreckage. We'll take that for free fuel. Less credits I have to pay for fuel. Something. something there, something there. Okay. There we go. Okay. Cool. We found what we were looking for. 
dig site. We're gonna get Garrus out this time. And Liara. Why not? Okay, so I'm going to put that Pearson mod on. There. Okay, Mr. Garris, you're going to get a phased in. There we go. Fire rate, less damage though, okay. Enhanced scope, don't really need that. We'll do extended barrel. Put spare clip on you. There we go. Do sabotage. Like that. Mr. Garris gets his class completely done. We'll do weapon damage, power damage, and power damage of squad mates. All right. Overload, armor piercing, and proximity mine. We'll get concussive shot up to three. We'll get overload, damage, neural shock, and shield. Okay. And Miss Liara has something she needs to do. We're going to do you. Then we're going to detonate your singularity field. Ah. All right. Warp needs to go next. Detonate. Damage. Oh, but we don't have enough. Okay. All right, here we go. So we got reports of an attack on an excavation site. Right. Edie, can you tell us anything else? This is the main site of a series of excavations established under Dr. Garrett Bryson. Staff records confirm the project lead is his daughter, Anne. She has recently uncovered another artifact possibly linked to Leviathan. That discovery must have made this dig site a target. Yes. An attack means we're on the right trail. And since Bryson's daughter is our only lead, our objective is clear. Cortez? Nothing so far, Commander. If she's down there, she hasn't responded to our hails. Getting some strange signals, though. Give me a minute. The artifact she uncovered may have caused additional problems. Who knows what we'll find? Agreed. Take us in closer. Copy that. Okay. 
We have hostiles! Take us in. Commander, on the landing platform! That's her. Okay, let's get... This! Tracking multiple phones! Get us over there. Negative, it's too hot. Heading to lower platform. Hang on! There, go! Jump! This isn't a dig site. It's a war zone. Move. She's somewhere above us. Hello? Is anyone there? I'm coming down. No. Stay where you are. This is Commander Shepard of the Alliance Base. Defeat. We'll come to you. Yes, okay. You should take the elevator up on the far side. Come oh, we will. Holy shit! Through here! Commander, they're swarming everywhere up here! Can you find a place to hide? Get there! Stay put! Watch out! Well, we're not getting up that way. Look for another path! Okay, cool. You gotta go back up, it looks like. Get down. Looks like a bridge over there. The controls are broken. Someone try to fix it. Right away. Some wires are short. It shouldn't take much to fix it. Give me a second. Raising the bridge now. Benji! See, I'm just taking out those banshees like they're nothing. <laughs> I remember I used to have so much trouble taking those fuckers out. Bridge is up! Move! That elevator can't be far! This way. Okay. Elevator spot. Got it. In. The elevator's blocked. Is there another way up? I'll override the pod door near you. There's an access point above, Commander, but you'll have to climb to it. Copy that. Thank you. What?
take the salvage. We'll take the ammo. You snuck up on me, didn't you, bitch? We're blocked. Find another way. Up we go. We can make it through here. Stay hidden, Doctor. We're trying, but there's too many of them. Hurry! This is a fun scenario right here. I love doing this. Even though it's hard to aim, it's still fun now to do. Okay. There he's dead. Cool. Man, are you still there? We're barely hanging on. Hopkins is wounded. Are you close? We're moving as fast as we can. Hang in there. Boom, boom. Ha <laughs> ha. That platform's coming down. Around. Go around. What's happening? Kirkwood and Boyle's trying to run for it. The Reaper's got him. Don't move until we get there. Take that. The elevator's up ahead. Get to it. Salvage, we'll take that. Med kit. Elevator controls. There's an elevator, there we go. Up we go. Elevator's online. We're coming up. Please hurry. I think Hopkins is dead. He tried to run. I told him not to, but he wanted to help the others. Where did everyone go? I'm sorry. They didn't make it. Doctor, I need you to come with me. Oh, God. Yes, of course. I... Uh was at another dig site when they attacked. I got back as quick as I could, but what's happening? Shepard, look. Oh shit, cave drawings. I'm not sure, but it might have something to do with these paintings. Is that Leviathan? Y yes Yes, we think so. It's, it's old, much older than my father thought. And there, 
as if the natives were under its power. Clearly a Reaper, but acting alone. Not like any Reaper we've seen before. Doctor, I understand you found something recently. The artifact? Yes, of course. Incredible. It's just ahead. It may sound strange, but I'm certain it affects people. Their behavior. I've only had a short time to study it. Not strange at all. Did you find anything? Not much, but I did learn something about the energy it generates. Get down! What are they doing? They've activated it. I've never managed anything. Doctor? They've learned to run. The darkness must not be reached. Shepard! Take it out! You okay? Cortez, we have Ann Bryson. Need a pickup. On my way, Commander. Copy that. You see the shuttle, you run. Don't look back. Okay. Yes. Keep spawning if you don't. You okay? Yeah, Commander. I I think so. I blacked out. Leviathan took control of him. We cut the connection before you got hurt. Leviathan itself? That's incredible. The Reapers seem as interested in it as we are. Yeah, it certainly seems that way. We were hoping you could help us figure out why. But first... Doctor, I have some bad news. Anne, please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers. Never went back to dark space, like a rogue, or even a defector. I have to call my father. He'll want to know. Anne, you need to listen to me, okay? Your father is dead. I'm sorry. He's... what? Dead? He can't be dead. We met with him, hoping to find out what he knew. Something happened. Something happened? You're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine, the next... He drew a gun on your father. I couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. Ben? I... I, I want to see his office. We'll arrange for transportation. Meet you there. Okay, so we need to check out the message here with Omega from Bray. Things are settling down on Omega. The talent of the new security force on the station. The leader said something about honoring Kandros' memory. I'd say they were being cute, except they're not shy about backing up the 
done it with firepower. Be careful out there. No, there's at least one battalion here that doesn't want you dead. Bray. Okay, we got all the assets here. We can head back and get the last of the assets and head out of here. Signal confirmed. Take the wreckage. Nice, we're full on fuel again. And what are we going to find here? There we go. We got everything. Nice. We're going back to Citadel. To Bryson's lab. Yes, I'm sorry. Just... This is hard. Of course. Are you all right? Yes. No. I don't know. <clears throat> My father and I didn't leave things in a great state. An argument? Yes. It was trivial. A disagreement on how to file some of the specimens. I was mad about something else. I don't remember what. And I took it out on him. It's so stupid. It's all right. I can come back. No, please. I'm okay. Seeing all this again. He was so obsessed. Crazy sometimes. I didn't get a chance to know him. Oh, sometimes I felt the same way. He was a great man, a pioneer, but he could be distant. I felt like an inconvenience growing up. You sound angry. I was angry. Still am, I guess. But sometimes, he was so full of stories, he nearly burst. I loved that about him. It's why I signed up for this work. <sighs> I can't believe he's gone. We'll figure this out. We have to. I need to know what's on the other end of that artifact. What he died for. We need your help. You're our last chance. You're right. Let me dig into my father's work to see what I can find. Anne. You sure you're up for this? Yes. When Leviathan took control of me, I remember being somewhere cold and dark. But my father taught me to never be afraid of the dark. Okay, so you gotta go down and talk to Anne again. I'm still amazed your father got his hands on a piece of a reaper. He was so excited. Your claims validated years of work. Did you take appropriate steps to prevent indoctrination? Of course. It was completely shielded, and we all had regular psyche evals. But now, thanks to the artifact, I'm indoctrinated anyway. 
aren't I? Might as well be a Rachni drone waiting for orders from the Queen. You studied the Rachni? I wrote my dissertation on them. My father thought it was a waste of time, but now? It might actually help us understand Leviathan. In what way? We think of the Rachni as telepathic, but there's really no such thing. At short range, the Queen uses pheromones to give orders. At long range, she uses an organic kind of quantum entanglement communicator. Whatever Leviathan does must be similar. Entangling particles to stimulate neural activity. It uses the artifact to establish a connection, and then it controls the mind of anyone near it. Okay. Where are you going now? Hey, loco. Need a hand? What brings you down here, James? Heard you're closing in on the Reaper Killer. Anything that can scare those bastards has to be worth a look. That's what I'm hoping. We didn't detect any energy emissions from the artifact. But the Reapers were able to use the artifact to trace Leviathan somehow. My theory is that most of the time the artifact simply acts as a receiver. We'll only be able to trace Leviathan through it when it actively takes control of someone. As it did on the asteroid. Right. Unless it needs something, Leviathan doesn't bother communicating. I guess it and my father had something in common. You said Leviathan's control was similar to a quantum entanglement communicator, which is untraceable. Yes, but this isn't a natural QEC. Leviathan has to send a pulse through the artifact to alter your mind and create the quasi-QEC effect. And that can be traced. Right, just like at the dig site. The Reapers were tracing the signal by activating the artifact. My father wanted to be at that dig site. He was getting too old for long digs, but he hated being stuck in the lab. He nearly missed my graduation because he was on a dig. Showed up still wearing his field gear. God, he'd have hated dying here. Anne, I know this is hard, but if there's anything more you can tell us. I don't think there's anything more I can tell you, but maybe I can show you. What are you saying? The artifact only sends out a signal when Leviathan's controlling someone. So let it control me. You could trace the signal. I don't like it, but we're out of options. Yeah, that's true. We are out of options. better than I do while Leviathan's capable of when threatened. I know it's a long shot, but I have to do this. You're looking for something to fight the Reapers, Commander. I'm looking for the monster that murdered my father. We still don't know what we're looking for. Then let's find out. Commander, this thing we're doing with Anne sounds dangerous as hell. Noted. Edie? Energy signature locked in. Waiting for activation. This is pretty gutsy. I don't know about guts. <sighs> Crazy, maybe. I'm gonna be right here. Okay. I'm ready. James, drop the containment shield. Shield is dropped. Artifact online. Anything? Nothing yet. Wait. There's something. I feel a chill. Edie? No trace yet. Holy hell! Signal is tracking. Maintain connection. Turn back. The darkness can't be breached. Yo! Maintain connection. Listen to me. I found you. And the Reapers are right behind me. You have brought them. You are a threat. So are you. I've seen what you can do. The war needs you. There is no war. There is only the harvest. Edie, do we have enough? Partial lock. Maintain connection to narrow the search. You heard her. We got enough. I'm hitting the shield. Relay that, Lieutenant. Signal is fading. Maintain connection. We can fight them. 
We can win this. The cycle cannot be broken. You're wrong. Focusing the point of origin. Maintain connection to narrow the search. I'm stopping this! Back off! Where are you? Where are you? Beyond reach. Trace complete. James! Doc! Okay. Yeah. We're good. Shit. Anne? Anne, talk to me. She's a mess. Edie, did we get it? We have a location. <sighs> Hang in there. Leviathan coordinates sent to the Normandy, Shepard. I hope it was worth it. It will be. I'm taking her to Med Lab. See you back on the Normandy. Alright, so now we get to do the final part of this DLC. And it'll be fun, too. There's Leviathan in the Sigurd's Cradle. Okay. I found something. All right, we found it. Match our trace of Leviathan. Well, now we're gonna land. So now we'll need Edie, I'm sure. We'll take Liara as well. We'll do fitness here. We'll do that. There we go. Okay. Cortez, what's the status on the probe we launched? Tracking it now, Commander. I've confirmed that Leviathan's signal originates from this planet. Heard how, uh, Anne helped us locate it. It's pretty spooky stuff. I'm still not sure what we're expecting to find down there. Dr. Bryson classified Leviathan as a Reaper killer. It appears it doesn't wish to be found. It doesn't have a choice. We're here. But then what? If it turns out to be a Reaper, are we really going to offer an alliance? We're not going to win this war by turning away help, even if it does have blood on its hands. Commander, new readings from the probe. It's narrowed down Leviathan's location. You're not going to like it. Let's hear it. There's nothing but ocean. Uh, show a concentration of structures floating on the surface, but the probe's giving us a signal below that. 
Way below. Underwater? Looks that way. The shuttle should still be able to reach it. That's possible. Kodiak is spec to nearly a thousand atmospheres. But I've never actually tested that. Guess we're gonna find out. Status! Some kind of pulse hit us! Systems are shutting down! Brace for impact! Everyone all right? I'm okay here. How's the shuttle, Cortez? Checking now. I'll see if I can get power restored. Copy that. We'll look around. It would seem others have been stranded here as well. We aren't the first to encounter that pulse. Could be Leviathan's last line of defense. Take the star charts. Any idea how old these are? The bones are untouched by scavengers. If they rotted clean from humidity and exposure, it might take more than a year. Shepard, it's one of the artifacts. Explains why no one gets out of here. Okay. Looks like a damaged atlas. Different though, and it's not flying Cerberus colors. It may not be Cerberus technology at all. Regardless, it doesn't work. I don't recognize any of these ships. How long have they been here? Nice! Level 3 for the cranial trauma.
Cortez is in trouble. Get to him! Yeah, shooting from the high ground really is not the greatest idea. Okay, we're clear. Status. Shuttle's a mess, Commander. That pulse knocked it right out of the air. We're not going anywhere. Why not have the Normandy pick us up? Same thing would happen to her. And the landing won't be as pretty. I'd say Leviathan has some sort of defense system in place. And we aren't getting out of here until we find it. So how do we do that? Well, you might be able to use a mech. Looks like it's rigged for diving. I'm game. We chased Leviathan this far. Let's finish this. It's a long ways down. Not gonna sugarcoat it. I hear you. Time's wasted. Shepard, perhaps you are unaware of the degree of risk. Are we seriously proposing... First, we'll need to restore power to get that cargo door open. How? I suppose we are. These old Ballard-class ships are equipped with exterior power sockets. They use them for emergency repairs. We can strip the cells from the shuttle and use those for juice. Hang on, I'll get you started. Got a cell for you, Commander. Find somewhere to plug that in. In we go. Did I get them both? That did it. Looks like we're in the clear now, Commander. Good. I need to get in the water before they come back. All right, Commander. Let's get you out of there, and I'll do a systems check. Shepard, I understand the reasons, but this is a big risk. No risk, no reward, damn it. Come too far to stop now. The way home is through Leviathan. Exactly. Hey, seals, check out. Oxygen pressure is nominal. Systems are a go. 
It's as ready as I can make it. Let's go. Take care down there, Commander. Closing hatch. Engaging systems. Ready. Testing comm link. I read you. Here goes. Commencing dive in three, two, one. Suicide dive! Looks good so far. Copy that. Cortez? Cortez! Okay, so we get to go on an underwater mission here. Light's gone now. Not sure if you can read me up there. Looks like I finished the major descent. Can't see much from here. Suit is holding up. Emergency systems have come online. Life support operation. Now this is just a straightforward um, path. You don't have to worry about branches and stuff like that. Down all non-critical systems to preserve remaining power. Not sure how much juice the emergency thruster will need to get me back to the surface. Can't worry about that now. Getting some strange readings from the probe. Something is definitely down there. <laughs> Reading the probe directly below me. Looks like the final drop. The final countdown! Whoa! Kinda like that scene from Goldeneye 007 where he jumps off the... Um... When he jumps off the dam. Intact. I'm gonna keep moving. Yeah, there's the probe we shot into the planet. What is that? Oh, that just pissed off whatever you shot at. Don't shoot at me, motherfucker! Oh shit! What the? Then 
What are you? What's happening? Your memories give voice to our words. Your nature will be revealed to us. Accept this. The galaxies have war with the Reapers. You defeated one. Why aren't you fighting back? There is no war. There is only the harvest. Then help us stop it. No one have possessed the strength in past cycles. Your own species could be destroyed with a single thought. But you are different. I have witnessed your actions in this cycle. The destruction of Sovereign. The fall of the Collectors. The Reapers perceive you as a threat. And I must understand why. saw the other races experience. Why? You cannot conceive of a galaxy that bends to your will. Every creature, every nation, every planet we discovered became our tools. We were above the concerns of lesser species. The intelligence was envisioned as simply another tool. And now we all pay the price for your mistake. There was no mistake. It still serves its purpose. How did you remain hidden all this time? Our extermination is not complete. Some survived and found refuge in the dark corners of the galaxy. I am their progeny. Over the cycles, the thrall races were controlled, removing traces of our existence as we directed them to. In this way, our survival was kept secret from the Reapers. Today, we reach out through the fragments and watch for discovery. Fragments? You mean the artifacts we found? They provide a window into the galaxy. Tools for exploring the events of this cycle for the safety of this world. Through them, we watch, we study, and remain in the shadows. How did the intelligence defeat you?
Will it ever end? Unknown. Until the intelligence finds what it's looking for, the harvest will continue. Do you know anything about the device we're building? It's supposed to be a super weapon. We have watched its construction before. It has never been completed. Those who have tried still fell victim to the harvest. Its outcome is unknown. Okay, you made your point. Will you help stop the cycle? I have searched your mind. You are an anomaly, yet that is not enough. Wait! The cycle will continue. No! You've been watching. You know this cycle is different. You will survive. You will remain here as a servant of our needs. The Reapers will harvest the rest. If you release me, no one has to be harvested. Nothing will change. You're responsible for this. Every race that's ever been destroyed is because of you. And now the Reapers will destroy you, too. Unless you start fighting. Even if you survive the battle today, the Reapers won't stop. Ever. Release me and we have a chance to end this, once and for all. So, these guys, the Leviathan, made the Reapers. And they fucked up by not Your making a failsafe. I've earned it. Out there fighting, where you should be. It's clear why the Reapers perceive you as a threat. No victories are more than a product of chance. We will fight, but not for you or any lesser race. We were the first, the Apex race. We will survive. And the Reapers who trespass on this world will understand our power. They will become our slaves. Today, they pay their tribute in blood.
Shepard! Goddess! He's freezing! <coughs> Are you all right? <coughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Hell of a headache. We're lucky we got you back. What happened down there? We found it. It's real. And a lot more than we ever imagined. So was it worth almost dying for? It was. We exposed it. Pushed it into the light. Whether it likes it or not, it's a part of this war now. And it's gonna help fight. It sounds like an impressive accomplishment. Yeah. One for the history books. Commander, I finished reading your report. The Alliance wanted more intelligence on the Reapers. I'd say we got it. Our people will be studying it for years to come. They're already calling it the Leviathan Codex. It rewrites galactic history as we know it. Whatever else it means, it tells me the Reapers had a beginning. And maybe now we'll provide them with an end. That's one way to look at it. I guess it's the only way. So go out there and make it happen. This is a big step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. Thank you, sir. Hack it out. All right. Well, we're going to call it for this um, video. We get an asset, the Leviathan Enthrallment Team. So I'm going to save it here, and then I'm going to call it for this video. So hope you all had fun. I'll see you on the next video.